Professor Zakharovsky, thank you so much for joining us today. It's great to have you with us. So let's talk about your lecture. The title of your lecture is From Pandemic to Azaic. Can you tell us about the key topic of your talk? Absolutely. Pandemic, we're all aware of it. It's all around the last two years. And we have learned so much from the pandemic, but there was another pandemic 70 years ago, and this was when intensive care medicine was born. And the first person who founded intensive care medicine was an anesthesiologist. And you'll be talking uh, in more detail about that. What would you like the audience to take away from your talk? I will talk absolutely in detail, but also about um, pandemics in general. But also I will give a message to the audience. And this is number one. We're doing something for society. We have treated so many patients and we have to make the public aware of what we're doing. And people don't know what we're doing. So that is one of the key messages. And how would you say Azaic has adapted to the challenges which have arisen um, from the pandemic? And how is it continuing to provide support for anesthesiologists and intensivists yes, worldwide? Uh, we had a transformation from the name of the society from ESA to Azaic and we included intensive care medicine. The reason is very simple, because uh, we did a study and found out that over 70% 70, 70 of all intensive care beds in Europe are run by anesthesiologists. So it was very clear we had to change our name. We as a society, we have to restructure now, adapt more to this uh, field of intensive care medicine, but also networking again, knowledge across borders, and also meeting friends and exchange. That is, I think, the most important things. It has been a transformative period for anesthesiologists and uh, the medical field as a whole. How would you say anesthesia care has been changing over the years? Oh, that's a good question. I mean, it's one thing is always financial pressure. Then, obviously, the most important thing is we do care for patients. We treat patients. We want to have the best outcome and the highest standard of patient safety. To bring all together with good people, we are evolving um, on, a, on a level, which is good, but we're aiming for more. And just finally, as usual, we have a really rich blend of sessions from all areas of anesthesiology and intensive care. What are you looking forward to most? That is, you know, um, for me, it's the most important thing that I can go inside, meet people face to face, and then I have certain other things I want to obviously attending, but I don't want to be in favor of something now because some people may, maybe feel a little bit sad. So I lo I'm looking forward to everything. Everything and getting back and meeting face to face. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Professor Zakharovsky, and we wish you a great meeting. Thank you very much.